Hello everyone, it's Jilly Jean. Let's go thrifting at my LC Goodwill. Six dollars. Two dollars. Large glass pitcher, nine dollars. Violet teapot, Staffordshire, England, four dollars. Three dollars. Dome cover butter dish, four dollars. Casins fine china, made in Japan, four dollars. Corning ware, but it's the newer one. It's not pyro ceram, it's stone ware. Anchor Hawking Smoky Glass Pie Dish, Autumn Reef, four dollars. And here's just an overview of their basket and brown section. I'm gonna turn you around. Happy campers. What's this? This looks like a wall decor and it's five dollars. It was originally from Ross. At the Christmas end cap. Brown bag, vintage cookie mold, set of three for seven dollars. Debbie Mum snowflake dinner plates, and this looks like it's from the 90s. Thirteen dollars. It's a bit expensive. Blue end cap. This is made to look vintage, but it's not vintage, and it's two dollars. Here's a look at the bowl section. Someone made these paper stars. It's priced at
I don't know how to say this. Is it Oneida or Juanita? Not sure. But it's a popular brand. $4. Yellow glass mixing bowl. And on the other side are the dishes. This look interesting. It looks like it's a pottery piece. I thought it might be by a studio artist, but it's made in China. It's quite big and he heavy. Nicely glazed though. Priced at $10. Fire King dish and it's four dollars. And at the knickknack aisle, I'm not seeing that much vintage items today. Footed crystal balls, not very interesting, but it's priced quite high at seven dollars. This one is priced at three, two dollars. This one is very detailed and nice. Off to the next Goodwill. The first thing I spot here is this large container full of Christmas decor. And it's priced at $22. Hummingbird music box. On the back of the head, it's just marked B. Six dollars. Recipe box. It's painted really nicely. Four dollars. Five dollars. A little rack. It's from Target. Overview of the Christmas end cap. I 
I think this is a candle votive. Birdhouse, $5. The color purple was on sale at the time of filming, so this birdhouse would only be $2.50. And in the dish aisle, A pretty reticulated porcelain plate. It looks like transfer wear. And it's four dollars. It's from Germany. It's really pretty. Under our Japanese stoneware are $3 each but this one has a little chip even though it's set of six if you wanted to get it you probably wouldn't want to get the chip one so a set of five in good condition Japanese luster wear dollar fifty popcorn container three dollars. This will be fun for your movie nights. These are pretty. These are Madrid by Spode, made in England. $2 and these are Corel but the flower pattern is really worn out and these look like they're Noritake dinner plates and yes they are $3 each in great condition as well. And more Spode Madrid dish set. The design is very pretty. Very pretty, and here's a large platter, $13. I wish it was in a different color. I think if it was blue or green, maybe it would be more desirable. But burnt orange, it's more fall.
more Japanese stoneware, very 70s, $3. And set of four. This, it says Murano glassware, but the quality is just not there. And seven dollars, it is made in China. In the glass section, these are Culver whiskey glasses and they're $2 each. It's Mark Culver. These are also Culver, you can see right here. Also $2. This one is, I don't think it's Culver, it's not Mark Culver, I'm not sure what they are. They're $2 each, and they're in great condition as well. Good quality. Highball glasses. Coffee makes me poop. $1.50. I don't think I want to drink out of that. These are nice big mugs, one dollar each, and they are by Better Homes. This pretty one is Pioneer Woman. Coffee bean mug. Coffee bean mug, one dollar. And these are small appliances. And I didn't show you, but this is a king size cotton sheet set is priced thirty dollars it's from target and it's brand new off to the next goodwill and in in the pots and pans section of course this goodwill has a lot of revere wear See, there's more right here. This one is seven dollars, and it's a five quart pot. And this one is a small three and a quarter saucepan, five dollars. $2 and they're very dainty tiny tea cups and they're Bavaria they may be espresso cups and 
It's so cute. Five dollars, Libby snowman jar. And this one says copyright 1978. Jim Davis Garfield jar and it's priced quite high at seven dollars. And the blue end cap. These are nice. It's two dollars. These are little potpourri containers. Two dollars. This one looks vintage and it's pewter top. It has an image of a cat and three dollars. Purple is on sale, so this would be a dollar fifty. And this is a serving dish, thirteen dollars, and it's by Rosenthal. Below are Mikasa cups and they're two dollars each. The handles look like in the style of English teacups. And an overview of Starbucks cup, four dollars, and this one is Disney. They look hardly used, almost new. And this is a vintage Aladdin thermos, three dollars. I remember these from back in the eighties. You put your Campbell soup inside, keep it warm.
and in the Christmas holiday section someone made this four dollars as a birthday gift and next to it I think this might be an Ellie Smith stars and moon tiny compote five dollars eight dollars Indiana glass cat voltive holder four dollars Well, this is my purchase for today. I purchased the Culver whiskey glasses. They were $2 each. And I was gonna gift this to my sister. And I also got the king size sheet set for $30. I needed some uh, replacement sheets for my bed and so even though it was quite pricey I did pick it up because at Target it would still be more expensive like even though it's on sale it would be like $36 plus tax so I picked it up anyways well I hope you enjoyed today's thrifting trip please let me know which item was your favorite don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos this is Jill Bye!